Hello everyone! Today we are happy to present you an awaited feature for Syscard Mouse Vendor – Vendor Plans. By using the Vendor Plans add-on, you offer vendor subscription plans with certain restrictions, such as maximum number of products and maximum revenue. The Vendor Plans add-on is a flexible tool that gives you carte blanche to create subscription plans for vendors and helps increase revenue. Vendor plans will replace vendor commissions starting from version 4.4.1. Before we proceed, let's go through the key features first. No installation required. The vendor plans add-on is included into the package by default. New management panel. All management tools are gathered at one place. Improved creating process. Easy creating process for new plans. User-friendly interface. Import expert feature to assign plans in a fast and easy way. The add-on is included in the new major version 4.4.1, which means that there is no need to download and install it separately after you upgrade to 4.4.1. Just like any other add-on, the vendor plans is located at Add-ons, Manage Add-ons. We recommend you to get acquainted with settings before you begin working with it. At the settings page, there are three settings available. Include shipping cost in vendor's commission. If you tick this checkbox, the shipping cost will be considered when calculating vendor commissions. Take payment surcharge from vendors. When this checkbox is ticked, vendors get entrusted to pay payment surcharges. Allow vendors to change their current plan. And if you tick this checkbox, vendors will be able to change the plan that you assigned to them from the start. The add-on itself can be found at Vendors, Vendor Plans. The Vendor Plans page can be roughly divided into three parts. Top panel allows you to add new plans, preview the plans page and delete several plans at once. A table with plans where you can edit, delete, activate and disable already existing plans. Search panel that helps to find the required plans. Click the plus button to create a new plan. You will see a pop-up with the plan settings divided into four tabs. To set up a plan, fill in the necessary fields on each tab. General tab. Name. The name of a plan. Offer as the best choice. Tick to show the plan as the best choice. Description of the plan. Position. The position of the plan on the vendor plans page. And plan status. Commission tab. Enter the price of the plan. Set up the payment period. Enter transaction fee. Restrictions tab. Max products. Set the maximum number of products a vendor can have on this plan. Or leave the field empty to allow an unlimited number of products. Revenue up to. Set the maximum amount of revenue a vendor can get per month. Or leave the field empty for unlimited revenue. Vendor microstore. Tick to allow a vendor to have a microstore with separate storefront, categories, filters and search. Categories tab. Choose categories which a vendor can use. The vendor will only have access to chosen categories. To let the vendor use all the categories, do not add any categories here. Click Save to create a new plan. There are two ways to display a link to the vendor plans page on the storefront. The first way is implemented through the menu. Go to Design, Menus, choose a menu, click Add Item button, make up a name for your item and enter the Vendor Plans page URL in the URL field. You can also use the already existing Become a Seller link. The second way is to implement the link through the block. Go to Design, Layout, choose where you want to create a new block. Click the plus button and choose Add Block. In the Appearance pop-up window, switch to the Create New Block tab and find HTML block with Smarty support. Make up a name for a new block, switch to the Content tab and enter the following line. Click Save to create a new block. Now there is a link on the storefront leading to a Vendor Plans page. On the Vendor Plans page, after choosing a plan, the soon-to-be vendors are redirected to the Apply for Vendor Account page. Here, they enter their data to apply for an account and can also change their vendor plan. 
Vendor plans can be not just chosen by vendors themselves, but assigned by the administrator. To do so, at the admin panel, go to Vendors, Vendors. Choose a vendor, switch to the Plan tab and assign the desired plan. Plans to multiple vendors at once, use the Import Export feature located at Administration, Export Data. To finish the presentation, let's speak about vendors themselves. Vendors can use special features to work with vendor plans. To be aware of restrictions, a vendor can monitor the limits of his or her plan in the dashboard. Also, a vendor can move to another plan right on the dashboard himself or on the plan tab of the vendor settings page. That's it for today. We would be very happy to hear your opinions on the new features and suggestions for improving them. Thanks for watching and see you in the next CSCART videos.